Okay. All right, ladies and gentlemen, how's it going today? It's your favorite Mexican raincoat here. I hope you're all doing well today. I'm not doing too bad myself. Today, we're gonna be talking about uh, this guy. Poncho is mean, exposed. Dude, I'm not that mean. Okay, so apparently this guy has gigabytes upon gigabytes of files stored on his computer. And these aren't any ordinary files, okay, ladies and gentlemen? These are the files to get my ass off of YouTube, man, all right? It's code red. This guy is a threat to my existence, and I want nothing to do with him. Anyways, let's watch. Also, go pre-save my album right now, right now, right now, right now. What's up, grocery bag gang? Oh? Gro grocery bag gang? Hey, what's up, my fellow trashers? It's your boy. I'm fucking pissed today. It's my last little bit of water. <laughs> Okay. okay, this exposed video is starting out a little rough, all right? I think he's trying to keep himself together so he can, you know, deliver this amazing reason as to why I should be exposed, or I don't know why exactly he's trying to make this video about me, but uh, let's keep watching. But that's besides the point. I'm not gonna cry this video. So listen, okay? There's this YouTuber that I've seen. I hate his content. You know, I hate Dumpy, I hate Kibo, I hate Dream fans, I hate Dream himself, and all his friends, but that's besides the point. God, this guy is name dropping everybody, bro. Why do you hate so many people? What do we do? Bro, I just make videos on Darman. Like, that shit's, I don't know what his problem is. I don't know, you name dropped Keed. I don't know, Keed's been kind of doing his own thing. Okay. You know who Darman is? Well, this guy named Poncho makes tons of videos about Darman. Way too many of them. They suck. Those views should be going to me. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, I think it's time that I retire my entire channel. And, you know, I'm just going to give it to him. All right, I'm just going to give my entire login credentials to this beautiful man right here. <laughs> Look at this guy. I'm really curious to find the point of this video where he actually goes into depth about anything that should warrant me to be canceled or deleted or whatever. So far, he's just rambling about my Darman videos, but uh, we'll see how much longer that continues. I've been trying to go to therapy for my anger, okay? <laughs> uh, okay, alright. It's just not fucking worth it. It's too expensive. <laughs> I ran out of water this week. You know what? <clears throat> so <what> I think. <clears throat> hey, nice. You, uh, you did that thing where, with, like, the smoke coming out of the bottle. Anyways, what are you doing? Like,. What are you doing? I feel like I'm watching this guy just break down. I don't know what's happening at all. I, I'm, I'm very confused by this point. I'm not sure if this is even a video exposing me anymore. I think it's just, uh... <laughs> to be honest, dude, I have no idea what this is. That's my fucking head. Okay. okay calm down. He's almost at 1 million subs, and I'm not, okay? Ah, uh, you spoke too soon, buddy! We're already here! Let's go! Silly man, thinking that we couldn't hit 1 million subscribers. We all proved them wrong. Gotta feel bad for this guy, man. I'm not gonna lie. He's sitting there doing, uh, absolutely nothing, but telling the world that I'm just an awful guy. He's still trying to vent out his frustrations with my channel, and he hasn't really got anywhere. But trust me, he'll make his purpose known later on. I, I promise. I fucking hate Poncho. Why is his lazy- Reaction commentary content, almost getting him to 1 million subs. Why did my lazy content carry me to 1 million subs? I don't know. I, like, I genuinely have no idea how to answer that, but I'm here. Okay, so he presented his first argument, all right? Uh, my content's lazy. Yes, my content is lazy. No shit, my content is lazy. I don't want to over-edit a video every single day. Dude, I'm a one-man operation. I edit all my own videos. I record all my own videos. Like, I do everything, dude. I'm not asking for pity or anything like that, but dude, uh, of course I'm going to keep it pretty simple. You know, I just don't have all the time to sit around all day editing my video. I got to just put it out. But hey, people like the simplicity. People like just the gameplay and me talking. Sometimes the pictures here and there, you know, I just like to keep it simple. And I can understand the side where people think that low effort content ruins the website, but honestly, as long as my video comes off as genuine, then I'm fine. So, so stupid. Just like his name. God, Mexican raincoat. That's literally what poncho means. Uh, 
Yeah. Okay, since I get asked this a lot, for those who don't know where the it's your favorite Mexican raincoat thing came from, this was actually a few videos into my channel, and I actually got a comment that said, you're my favorite Mexican raincoat. Because, you know, Poncho, that's my name, and that's like kind of what people look at a Mexican raincoat as, a poncho, but with the O. You know what I'm talking about. And you know, here's a little grocery bag tip, okay? I know fucking Spanish, all right? My biblioteca is rojo. All right, ladies and gentlemen, watch out. Grocery bag man knows Spanish, okay? Well, he's a dangerous weapon. Everybody back up, okay? We're not ready for his wrath. La biblioteca is rojo. What he just said was the library is red. What? You know what that means? It means grocery bag man is the best. All right? You guys just wouldn't understand it. I mean, unless, you know, Spanish-speaking viewers, you can tell me all you want in Spanish, and I will understand. But another thing, Poncho's video's way too long. All right? I would rather sit and watch paint dry than to watch a full f***ing Poncho video. All right? Poncho videos are... Ugh. God. <laughs> what I do? What I do? This man hates me so much for no reason. My guy, I want to connect. Grocery bag man, I know you have a few problems with my channel, all right? I hear you. I hear you. But listen here, man. I'm willing to be your friend, okay? Judging that you made this video about me, uh, I can tell that you're struggling with friends right now. <sighs> I'm sorry. I'm just, I'm just thinking about... All the time I, you guys can spend supporting me. <laughs> okay. You hear that? All that time laughing about that vegan teacher and all that time laughing about Darman. Kiss those memories goodbye, okay? This guy deserves all of your attention. Why do you ask? I don't know. But he's going to make sure that he has all of your guys' attention, okay? At all times. This man is the new commentary channel leading 2021, fellas. Okay, Poncho is a cringy ass haircut, okay? Bro, uh, it's not awful. It's not that bad. What the fuck, man? Now this guy has me very insecure about my haircut, and I'm not gonna lie, boys, I feel sad. You know what? Okay, guys, I'm done, okay? My videos, I have this Red Bull can, right? My videos take a lot of effort to make. Hey man, we're in this one together, all right? I spend $159,000 per video every single day, actually, just for those who uh, weren't aware. Clearly, I can see that you're putting a lot of effort into this video, man. You're doing a great job. Okay, I'm so sick of these stupid fucking commentary YouTubers reacting to stuff and reacting to me. Like, don't be does and like, keep this every foot react to me. They don't see the struggle I go through. I've rose through the grind. I've gone through the grind. I'm 37 years old. And these assholes don't get it, okay? You know, I'm, it, I'm done, okay? <laughs> what is this guy doing? Okay. Calm down. R relax, my man. I guess the conclusion that we can draw from this video is to uh, never make a poncho exposed video or else uh, I'll come to your house and you don't need to make a poncho exposed video because I'm a nice guy. Anyways, ladies and gentlemen, if you enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like. And if you want to see more content like this in the future, feel free to subscribe. Again, please make sure to go pre-save my album that I produced and performed on. I also had my friend Fat Dolsk on it. And uh, yeah, go pre-save that. I guess every single time one of you guys pre-saves the album, it boosts to me and the algorithm on Spotify. So please do that. It would help a lot. And yeah, with that being said, I hope y'all have a good one and I will catch you guys tomorrow. Peace out.